Well, the growing trend in local food board services uh, is a great way, many people say, to entertain throughout the holiday season. Several Hoosier companies are creating mouthwatering and impressive spreads in the process. In this month's Trendiana segment, Yelp's Brittany Smith returns with some tasty details. Uh, Brittany, welcome back to the show. Great to be back with you, Gary. Yeah, okay, food boards, charcuterie boards, been around for a long time, but they're really gaining in popularity so much so that businesses uh, are really beginning to cash in. Oh, definitely. And there's these are perfect for entertaining, whether it's the holidays, you've got folks coming over, corporate events, or just a date night at home. These businesses have really reached out and made creative ways to make something fun out of grazing boards. All right. As always, you've got a great tour around the state of uh, some businesses uh, in the food board uh, arena. And we begin in southeast Indiana with Board and You in New Albany. Yeah, the owners, Zach and Sean, started this business out of a friendly competition as co-workers. And it, since, there, since that, it's actually kicked off into a brick and mortar business and also all the custom orders that they're taking. You can go in, you can have your board, your wine, your beer, or you can make orders for keto boards or veggie filled boards. They really do a great job with dietary restrictions. Okay, we can travel up I-65 from New Albany to Columbus and gourmet grazing of boards. Yeah, this is a family owned and operated business, all hands on deck. It actually kicked off during COVID. I want to show off, they do a really great job, as you can see here, oh, wow. of all the different textures, mm -hmm. variety of flavors. So that everyone that's attending your gathering, when the workplace or whatever it is, is going to find something on the board that they love. And if you want to try it firsthand, they're even offering workshops in Columbus. Oh, okay. Um, 317 Charcuterie is in Carmel. Yeah, this business just opened up this month in Carmel, right there on City Center Drive, woman-owned business from a Butler alum, another brick and mortar one where you can try some craft beer, wine, boards. They even have some fun uh, date night packages. So if you want to get something like the couple's graze box to take home or to enjoy in their space, it's good for planning ahead for your next date night. Okay, in Bloomington, there is Blooming Boards. Yeah, this one was a self-described hobby turned into an obsession, which turned into a business. They're even creating COVID-friendly cupcuteries is what they call them for individual servings. You know, if you don't want to have a full spread out at your gathering, but you're going to notice that these are offering beautiful meat and cheese boards, chocolate boxes with chocolate covered strawberries and pretzels. So you can offer something for dessert or as the main entree. Okay, don't want to leave our friends in northern Indiana uh, out of the picture this week. Grazed by Erica is in Elkhart. Yeah, this stemmed out of a love for just bringing people together, and you can truly see that each board is a work of art, and no two boards are the same. She's even offering brunch boards that include artisanal cheeses and salmon and bagel boards. They're truly beautiful, so you're going to find something uh, for each audience there. Okay, food bar, uh, boards, charcuterie, uh, really a growing business, a trend around the state of Indiana. Brittany, great as always. And, and I do want to make sure we offer congratulations. Brittany has not been with us for a few months for a very good reason. There is Fletcher, her little four-month-old uh, boy. So cute, uh, beautiful oh, baby. Brittany, congratulations you. there. They are with uh, husband David. Great pictures. Uh, really happy for you. Thank you so much, Gary. It's great to be back. Okay, are you getting any sleep? <laughs> Very limited, but I'm, I'm operating. I'm still operating. <laughs> okay. The, the good thing is it gets better eventually. <laughs> I am, am holding on to that very much. <laughs> so, well, congratulations. We're all very happy for you. Thanks so much. Okay. Talk to you soon.